The James Webb Space Telescope's humanity's most advanced eye in the cosmos has pushed the boundaries of what we know about the universe. Recently, it sent back images that have left scientists speechless, capturing phenomena that challenge our understanding of the cosmos. Among its latest feats, Webb revisited the iconic pillars of creation, a celestial masterpiece located in the Eagle Nebula. First captured by Hubble's telescope in 1995, these massive clouds of gas and dust have never been seen in such detail before. Webb's infrared technology unveiled stars forming within the pillars, some of which are only a few hundred thousand years old. The discovery is not just breathtaking, it also deepens our understanding of star formation and raises questions about the forces shaping these celestial structures. After a success with the Pillars of Creation, the James Webb Telescope turned its gaze to the Pandora Cluster, a region of space named after the mythical figure known for her curiosity. And just like Pandora's box, Webb's observations revealed unexpected wonders. Using Einstein's theory of general relativity, Webb captured a stunning panoramic view of Abel 2744, showcasing around 50,000 sources of infrared light. This include galaxies previously hidden from view, now brought to life by the telescope's unparalleled capabilities. The advanced imaging techniques used by Webb allowed scientists to peer deeper into the cluster, uncovering intricate details about the galaxy's structure and composition. These findings could revolutionize our understanding of how galaxies evolved over millions of years. Webb's exploration didn't stop there. It turned its instruments toward WR-140, a distant star surrounded by concentric, wave-like rings. But what caught scientists off guard was the peculiar shape of these rings, slightly squared, as if in motion. While initial theories suggested these rings were caused by light diffraction, further analysis revealed more mysteries. The stars seemed to emit waves of material, each expanding outward and creating the striking pattern observed by Webb. This discovery not only showcased Webb's precision but also raised questions about the life cycle of stars and the forces shaping their surroundings. The most shocking discovery came when Webb detected faint red galaxies at the very edge of the observable universe. These galaxies, estimated to be 50 times more massive than previously known galaxies, formed when the universe was only 3% of its current age. The existence of such massive galaxies at a time when the universe was still young challenges existing cosmological models. How could they form so quickly after the Big Bang? What processes could create such enormous structures in such a short time? To confirm these findings, scientists plan to revisit these galaxies with Webb, using its spectroscopic capabilities to analyze their light and uncover their secrets. The implications for understanding the universe's early stages could be profound. The James Webb Telescope's infrared technology has allowed it to see through dense cosmic clouds and dust, uncovering hidden regions of the universe where stars are being born. These star nurseries previously invisible to other telescopes, offer a glimpse into the earliest stages of stellar formation. Among its discoveries is a cluster within the Tarantula Nebula, known as 30 Doradis. Webb revealed hundreds of young stars and protostars in various stages of development, offering astronomers a real-time view of how stars evolve. These findings could reshape our understanding of how stars form and the role of cosmic dust in the evolution of galaxies. Webb's groundbreaking technology extends beyond distant galaxies and clusters. It's also unlocking secrets about planets outside our solar system. By analyzing the light passing through exoplanets' atmospheres, Webb can detect the chemical signatures of their compositions. Among Webb's most exciting discoveries is the detection of water vapor in the atmospheres of WASP-96b, a distant gas giant. 
This marks a significant step forward identifying planets that could support life. These observations paved the way for future studies of smaller rocky planets that might resemble Earth, bringing us closer to answering the ultimate question, are we alone in the universe? The James Webb Telescope has provided new insights into one of the universe's greatest mysteries, dark matter. By observing gravitational lensing, where massive clusters bend light from objects behind them, Webb has created a detailed map of dark matter distribution. One of the most significant observations is the enhanced resolution of lensing effects, allowing scientists to better understand and estimate the mass and behavior of these invisible structures that make up 27% of the universe. This breakthrough brings us closer to understanding the elusive nature of dark matter and its role in shaping the cosmos. Another major revelation from Webb's observations is its contribution to measuring the expansion rate of the universe. By analyzing the redshift of galaxies, light stretched as the universe expands, Webb has provided unprecedented accuracy in determining how fast our cosmos is growing. The results, however, have deepened the mystery. Webb data suggests a discrepancy between the expansion rate of the early universe and the rate observed today, hinting at unknown forces or phenomena influencing cosmic growth. These discoveries challenge existing cosmological models and raise profound questions about the ultimate destiny of the universe. Will it expand forever or will one day collapse back into itself? One of the James Webb Telescope's primary mission is to uncover the first light object, galaxies and stars that formed in the initial few hundred million years after the Big Bang. These ancient structures hold the key to understanding the universe's infancy. Webb has already detected some of the faintest and most distant galaxies ever observed, their light traveling for over 13 billion years to reach us. These findings are helping scientists reconstruct the early stages of cosmic evolution, providing insights into how matter coalesced into stars and galaxies. While Webb excels at studying the birth of stars, it has also provided unprecedented view of their deaths. When massive stars reach the end of their lives, they explode as supernovae, scattering heavy elements across the universe. Webb's ability to capture these dramatic events in intricate detail has allowed astronomers to study the life cycles of stars more closely than ever before. The telescope has even observed the formation of elements like hydrogen, carbon, and iron, building blocks of life within these stellar explosions. By studying these cosmic events, Webb's is shedding light on how the elements essential for life are created and distributed throughout the universe. Quasars, some of the faintest objects in the universe, are powered by supermassive black holes consuming vast amounts of material. The James Webb Telescope has turned its focus to some of the farthest quasars ever observed, providing new insights into these enigmatic phenomena. These ancient quasars formed when the universe was still in its infancy, offering a glimpse into the growth of black holes and their influence on the galaxies that surround them. Webb's data is helping scientists understand how these energetic objects shape their environments, fueling galaxy formation and influence cosmic evolution on a massive scale. While the James Webb Telescope has revealed the stunning beauty of galaxies and nebulae, it has also provided insights into the vast emptiness of cosmic voids, regions of space with almost no matter or light. These voids, spanning hundreds of millions of light years, challenge our understanding of the universe's structure. Why are they so empty? And what forces created these vast, barren regions? By studying the boundaries of the voids, and the galaxies that surround them, Webb is helping researchers piece together the puzzle of how matter is distributed across the universe, revealing a balance between chaos and order in the cosmos. The James Webb Space Telescope has not only pushed the boundaries of our understanding of the universe, but has also transformed the way we see ourselves within it. Its discoveries, spanning star formation, ancient galaxies, 
and mysterious voids have unveiled the cosmos more intricate and awe-inspiring than we ever imagined. Each image sent back by Webb is more than just a snapshot of the universe. It is a window into the past, a glimpse of creation itself, from the faint glow of the first light object to the vibrant remnant of dying stars, Webb has painted a picture of a universe that is both chaotic and beautifully orchestrated. But with these revelations come new questions. What forces drive the formation of galaxies at the edge of time? Could the enigmatic regions of cosmic voids hold the key to the universe's fate? And what does the discovery of distant, Earth-like exoplanets mean for the possibility of life beyond our own solar system? Web Missions reminds us of the power of curiosity, the unyielding drive to seek answers in the vast unknown. It is a testament to human ingenuity and collaboration, uniting scientists, engineers, and dreamers from all around the world in a shared quest to explore the cosmos. As we look to the future, web discoveries are just the beginning. They pave the way for new telescopes, missions, and technologies that will take us even deeper into the mysteries of space. Each breakthrough brings us closer to understanding the fabric of the universe and our place within it. The James Webb Telescope has shown us that the universe is not just a collection of stars and galaxies, it is a living story, unfolding across billions of years. And with each new discovery, we turn the page on the greatest adventure of all, the quest to understand the cosmos. Share your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe for more.